What is up, Alabama fans? Stacy Blackwood here from the Tide Talk Podcast. And as we know, Alabama got spring practice started last Friday with their first practice of the spring. They're going to be off this week for spring break, but then they'll be returning to the practice field next week to continue uh, their development here in the spring. So we're excited about that. Wanted to get a quick video out just to kind of talk about some of the things that we're excited about this spring. As you see here, Bill O'Brien is returning for his second season with Bryce Young as the starting quarterback at Alabama. A lot to be excited about there of course Bryce Young is the reigning Heisman Trophy winner so there's plenty to be excited about at the quarterback position and it's always nice to return coordinators in college football especially at a place like Alabama where you see such a heavy turn coaching turnover uh, at this level uh, but Bryce Young is a guy who, who you have to be excited about like I said the reigning Heisman Trophy winner but who's going to back Bryce up uh, is it going to be a second year player Jalen Milrow or is it going to be true freshman early enrollee uh, Ty Simpson so there's a little battle there for QB too of course Will Anderson is also back uh, who doesn't love Will Anderson maybe the best player in all of college football and he's got a great book in and Dallas Turner as well on the other side on the defensive line you see guys like DJ Dale Justin Aboyby uh, a lot of depth and a lot of experience returning to that defensive line group you also see our new offensive line coach and Eric Walford uh, uh, he's going to bring a different style a different type of coaching so uh, maybe he can be more relatable to the offensive line guys there than what Doug Marone was last season. Uh, you see some of the running backs, Trey Sanders, he's looking healthy. It's nice to have him. You see Jameer Gibbs, the transfer from Georgia Tech. A lot of depth and a lot to be excited about at that position because we also returned Jace McClellan and Roy Dell Williams as well. Uh, freshman Jamarian Miller is also early enrollee, so there is a lot to look forward to at that running back position as well. And of course the offensive line. Who's going to step up and be a guy there? Same thing for the wide receiver group. We just need guys to step up at those two position groups, and I think you're going to be fine. Spe speaking of stepping up, number three right there, Jermaine Burton, the Georgia transfer at wide receiver. Uh, he is a guy that I don't think people are really talking about enough. Uh, nobody talked about Jamison Williams last season uh, before he, he hit the field and showed what he was capable of. And I think – I believe that Jermaine Burton is going to – uh, do a lot of the same things. I'm not going to say he's going to have quite the impact that, that Jamison Williams had, but I think he's a guy that not enough people are talking about. So there's a lot to look forward to. Uh, one quick question I want to ask before we wrap it up is who, who is a guy that you're looking at this spring to step up and take the next level uh, for the Crimson Tide? But that's going to wrap this video up. I really appreciate everybody tuning in. Until next time, roll tight.